Hi Pisces, how are you all doing? So let us see what is coming up for the general energies for the week Pisces and also the love energies for the week. Pisces, what is coming up guys? Pisces. We have the Ace of Earth. I feel for a few of you, you want stability, Pisces. <clears throat> you are done with being in situations that does not bring you stability, especially the way that you were brought up. You are done with those ways. Right now, all I see is that you want stability, you want uh, to be a leader. I also feel Pisces, you're starting to actually take the responsibilities. You are coming up as a person who is very mature. That is how people see you. They see you as somebody who is like upfront, taking responsibilities. Maybe before you were not so much like that, but right now I see a lot of responsibilities coming up for you guys Pisces and also in the future upcoming future with the four of air this is a card that comes up when you are all up in your head you are just having too many thoughts that is very very hard for you to process you have just have too many thoughts you're thinking a lot nowadays you're just like why have I gone wrong what did I do in order to be in this situation? What was the mistake? So you're sitting there thinking and wondering. For a few of you, um, you grew up with a single parent or I also feel like you have really suffered in your childhood. You've gone through some kind of a childhood trauma. And uh, such situations have definitely made you realize certain things in your life is what I see. Let us pick a few more cards for your general situation, Pisces. For few of you, you are even thinking about how you can improve your lives. Again, the eight of air. You are in search of something you're in your imagination you're in search of something if you can see this angel here she's searching for something in the clouds you are up in your thoughts too much i feel like you're imagining you're in your thoughts for some of you this can be something uh, that's negative also so try to step into reality because you're too much in your imagination pisces my beautiful pisces i know you are somebody who loves to be in that situation in your thoughts a lot but i see like you also need to come into reality right now because we want you pisces with the four of earth you're trying to be more grounded to the people around you so the thing that i'm getting here is we have total opposite energies the air energy and the earth energy the air is like totally in so you are in both the spectrums you are in your imagination all day or you are in the practical side of life all day so try to balance out these energies so that it's going to really help you live a balanced life otherwise you're just going to be having a life that's all imagination or all reality you're not going to have a balance in it right so it has to be half fantasy and half reality two more cards about your feelings about your feelings right now feelings okay you're missing something here you are worried you're missing something here for some of you you might also have a stomach ache or you might have some kind of a problem bodily issue 
not healthy right now <clears throat> which can also be an issue for you i feel like you are worried about something you were worried about something you are having some kind of a trouble you're going through some kind of a trouble but this card as it came out in reverse all of this is going to disappear all of this troublesome situation this sadness with the six of water is a lot of emotions that you're dealing with you're going through a lot of emotions you're going through a lot of thoughts lot of emotions you don't know where to begin you don't know what to do in your life you are confused as crazy is what i feel why are you confused pisces with the eight of earth also you're trying to improve yourself with the things that you know especially i would say like if you are an artist you're trying to grow yourself up in that field if you are a lawyer if you are a scientist you're trying to grow yourself with the knowledge and with the creative aspects that you have with yourself which is beautiful this is a positive card again a earth energy so you can be also dealing with a virgo a capricorn a taurus or you can be dealing with a scorpio cancer pisces aquarius libra gemini with a page of fire this is a fiery energy wow beautiful you don't know your worth pisces i feel like you you are amazing pisces so if you put your heart and soul into something you are definitely going to achieve it it's just that with these cards i feel like you don't know your worth you are amazing you are all courageous you can see there is a white tiger here which represents courage it represents braveness it represents stability it represents that fiery furious energy so now is the time if you put your energy into action it is going to manifest great things for you pisces also there is um there's somebody in your life who sees you as a passionate person i mean they never got the passion in this relationship with you and they never got it with anybody else so they see you as somebody who is very very passionate some uh, who can be of your love interest okay uh, that is making this person think about you more they see you as somebody who is more direct who is more like romantic more more like fun loving i don't know guys this person right now your person is confused because they never has met anybody like you and even if they would somebody right now they still like miss you they still think about you okay it's just going that way which is the reason this person's all sad right now okay let me pick out a few more cards for you guys so i will be picking out cards from the prince tarot i'll arrange these cards I will be not reading these cards in reverse. I will just be reading them upright because if I am going to read these cards in reverse, it's going to take like literally a long time for me to get the energies out. So, spirits, I'm just going to read these cards upright. So, give me the energies for my Pisces. 
the love energy, Pisces love energies, Pisces general love energies. If you want a detailed reading with me, you can book a personal reading with me. Three of Swords, definitely a betrayal, Pisces. This person has betrayed you or you have betrayed this person. Okay, take it as it resonates. It may or may not resonate, but take it as it resonates. Page of Wands. Okay. There is a lot of growth here. This person wants to come in. They want to come into your life. They are waiting. They are waiting for you to come into their lives. It's just like this person just hopes. They have hopes about this relationship. They just hope that something magical would happen and that you both will be reunited. I don't know why. Maybe this person cheated you. Maybe they are the one who left. But right now this has changed Pisces this is this is amazing this has changed something has changed within this person something has made them realize something about you let us take more cards Pisces Pisces yes if you can see this person at nights they're like going for out for a long walk as they see the birds and like the animals kind of together with its partner or like they see people holding hands and like walking as a couple like as they see the people around them it is it is just striking to them that they meet somebody like that and they need somebody like you i mean even if they have a partner with them right now maybe this person is not like how they expected or that is not what they dreamed about all day okay so this person is definitely more focused in your energy right now pisces so now is the time pisces for those of you who are trying to communicate now is the time because this person is going to communicate back they're going to text you back Okay, let us pick out more cards for this person's energies. What else is going on with this person? Five of Pentacles. So, I feel like the person, whoever is with this person, is not valuing them like they are supposed to. It's not giving this person that comfort that they need okay the comfort that they got with you is amazing and uh, something is missing in that relationship that they're having with the other person which uh, that you have given this person right so this is something that this person's missing and that is why they want to step in with you I also feel like there are certain things that this person's holding back to, like whatever you did, like maybe you also have had arguments and situations with this person. Okay, something okay, something also wrong with your relationship with this person which can affect this person in a way and which is like making them think should i step into this connection or should i like just move on because i've already went away from the person should i like move on or should i come back because they know back of the heads that you are going to be with them they you are going to wait for them right with the moon card again this person just thinks about you a lot a moon card is like that intuition is asking them to move forward with you they have a strong pull a strong magnetic pull towards you okay 
So even if this person knows that this is something that's very difficult for them, it's just something that they cannot resist. They cannot resist your magnetic pull. Even though they're with somebody else, it's just so hard for this person to not be without you. They want to step in. They want to have this connection. They want to move forward. Okay, something like that. This person's also willing to step forward. But then they also confused on like what's going to happen if they step forward. Are the things going to go haywire? There's also some kind of a fear in this person's mind into what's exactly going to happen if they are going to step in and do come into this relationship. Okay, I will just be picking out uh, some um, angel message cards. Just three angel message cards. And I will be done with your reading, guys. Angel message cards. What is coming up for my beautiful Pisces? What is coming up for my beautiful Pisces? This person wants you. They have that magnetic pull towards you. But they are just hiding it. They are not going to communicate. I really don't know why. into the light so the angels are telling you to actually move out of the darkness whatever darkness that you have been inside for a long time it's time for you to view that as something unnecessary and step into the stuff that actually make you a better person right this is a um, angel message it can be small habits as like um, waking up early, going to the gym, and like maintaining a healthy diet, or it can be something like quitting alcohol, or quitting some kind of a substance abuse, or something like that, okay? So just make sure that you are keeping yourself in the light, in a path of light, okay? So that the universe is going to bless you with abundance. And below the deck, we have the love card, so... There's definitely a lot of love surrounding you, especially with the people around you. Okay, you're just like finding it difficult to see it. So take the love from the people around you and try to manifest that into your physical reality, right? So this is the reading for you guys. I will be just picking out one more card. Be free. So try to also bring out that spirit within yourself. Try to do the things that you actually love. Try to find out what you actually love that is good and you actually love it and you can grow in it. Okay, and do that because that is going to give you a beautiful life. So yes guys, this is the reading for you, my beautiful Pisces. See you all tomorrow, Pisces. Bye.